Hi, what is up guys? Jared Campisi here with my good buddy Dotto, and this is another episode of the Carbon Panigale series where we take a beautiful 1299 Ducati Panigale, we customize it, and then we give it away when we're done. If it's something you'd like to be entered to win this bike and support and make these videos possible, this series, uh, head on over to patreon.com slash Customs. Uh, today we're going to be installing some more goodies onto this bad boy. We're slowly getting there, so we're getting towards the end of this series, so if you're interested in being a part of it, now is the time. Sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. Alright, so before we get started, I wanted to have Teens and I unbox this uh, beautiful, is it a TIG welder? So it's a TIG welder from Longevity Welding. Uh, Simon sent this over to us for Dotto actually, and we just want to really say thank you to Simon. Um, this is the same person who sent over the plasma cutter that Dotto's been using on his truck frame repair, and then this TIG welder Dotto's going to be using on his um, Scrambler Super Sport build, his Ducati Super Sport build, and then if we ever do get into like custom stuff in the series in the future, we're gonna have a badass welder to do some stuff for as well. So if you guys are interested in picking up anything from Longevity, definitely check them out. The owner of the company owns a, a 1199 Panigale S in black, and he also has a BMW. So he's a fellow bike lover, and you know that's what we're all about here on this channel. So. We got all kinds of stuff in this box. Dotto is probably in heaven right now. Oh my God. <laughs> what is this? Teens, what do you got there? Are these I the have grounds? no idea what I have here. This one's still connected, so you need to be careful. This is really heavy. <laughs> this box was like 60 <laughs> pounds. And we were loading it in the car, coming over. I was like, Teens, just go ahead and throw that box in the car. And she goes, oh, okay. And she goes like this. She goes, what the hell? <laughs> is that all connected? Oh, there it is. Look at that thing. Look at that thing, dude. Oh, damn it. <laughs> Dotto's already breaking stuff. What do you there think, Dotto? Oh, this thing is monstrous. This is like one of their newest ones, huh? Are you a kid on Christmas? I am a kid on Christmas. 280DX. This is actually a hell of a lot nicer than I anticipated. And uh, it has pulse and everything on there. I am ecstatic. The first project I think is going to be my stainless exhaust for the scrambler build. Don't paint over there. <laughs> I'm not. Cool to see it. Oh yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah. Um, thank you so much, man. Uh, and I'm gonna do a review on my on my YouTube channel yes. as well. So. so it'll be linked. Dotto's channel will be linked in the description below. And then also you can check out more on his Instagram and stuff like that. So and we'll be you'll be seeing it in our videos as well. So thanks, Simon. Woohoo! Teens found donuts. She's in heaven. What do you got, babe? I don't know. I'm cutting them up. <laughs> I don't know. She's just going to town over here. Look at her. Are they good? Yeah. Yeah. Did you have any? I got a big nut. <laughs> I've been recording the whole time. Okay, so today we're gonna be installing some blacked out uh, upper and lower radiator guards. Um, very important to not only complete the look of the bike, but also to make sure that rocks and stuff aren't screwing up your radiator, which is basically what keeps this bike cool. And if you guys have watched any of my videos, you know these bikes run pretty hot, so you don't want that getting screwed up. So there you go, upper and lower, super simple, super light, and they're all just gonna help complete that blacked out look. And as always guys, if you ever wanna get any of these parts, they're gonna be linked in the description below. And you can use code CAMPEASY to save yourself anything you order from Moto Million. They're the sponsor of the series. Manny is the one that helped us get all of these parts. So we really, really appreciate you guys supporting what we do. It's a great way to support. Yeah. This is something really special. I, I don't think I've ever seen these on a bike before, like on the street. Have you, Dotto? No. <laughs> Carbon fiber Look at that. And caliper it's brake cooling ducts. Look at that. Freaking so cool animal. Awesome. So basically, they're going to sit over top the caliper or next to it, and it's going to help funnel air onto the caliper. Stuff like that will help with like brake fade. It'll help keep the, the brakes from overheating and things like that. You're probably not going to need it on the street. Make it into the longevity box, right? There's no way in hell you're gonna Ah, oh, I was close. Not even close. Yeah, I was close. <laughs> um, yeah, you're probably not gonna get a lot of brake fade on the street, but if anyone's gonna track this bike, which it would be an insane track weapon, that's when you would want stuff like that. Plus, it's just cool to have. It's kind of like a specialty part, again, from Moto Million, which is really cool. And then the last thing we're gonna do today, which is something everyone's been asking us about, Stickers. is install some factory Ducati stickers on the bike. So I had originally ordered two sets. I got a set of silver and a set of gloss black. I asked the patrons which ones they wanted and they said gloss black hands down. 
So that's what we're gonna put on. So we got the gloss, and, and it's kind of cool because if you guys have ever seen the 848 uh, Dark Edition, they, it was a black uh, 848, and then they put oh, uh, glossy so black good. stickers on it. Yeah, it's gonna look so amazing. It's actually yeah, 1299 is where it will go. Oh, so so we'll compare the stock stickers and make sure we line them up perfectly, and we'll wipe the whole bike down and everything. It's gonna be exciting. I'm excited for this. So. All right, so we're starting with the radiator guards. The first thing we need to do is yeah, take the uh, the padded stickers that they send us and mark them every, what was it, 10 millimeters? 10 millimeters or yep. three eighths of an inch. Three eighths of an inch, mm -hmm. Teens is doing that for us. And we also peeled the stickers off and Christina found a nice place for those. For the twins. Booby tassels, <laughs> nip, nip sticks. <laughs> Dotto's face. Teens goes Dotto, do you have scissors? Look well, at this. these aren't scissors. They might not be they're, scissors, well, but they're the? still, yeah, of course. <laughs> you can cut that beak of yours off. Ka -ka! <laughs> oh, whoa, whoa, you're gonna need bigger scissors than that. <laughs> you know what, that's messed up. That is messed up. How am I supposed to even do this? You better apologize right now. <laughs> yeah. He doesn't have scissors. All he has is shop scissors. Look at him. I have scissors. Me, Dotto. These are scissors. Are they okay. scissors? From 1945. Yeah, but they still the work, don't they? <laughs> no, it got warm. It was a little warm, warm. So apparently, the Cold War scissors are the best. Are the best for this. If you guys don't have these, you can purchase them at my site, <laughs> ColdWar.com. ColdWarScissors.com. Got, we, we add a little bit of rust onto the radiator guard stickers. <laughs> just just for authenticity's sake, you know? So we just went through and laid them out and made sure we have enough for each thing. And then Teen's just gonna go ahead and peel off the backs and start sticking them on there. I'm surprised they're not all on her nipples. Sticky wicky, hey, I've got some extras. Look at her. Stay tuned. Patreon.com slash Christina K. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Teen's got it done. Let me see it. So the bottom radiator guard is all padded up. That's so that it doesn't rattle. Yeah, it doesn't rattle while we're riding like ballers because I'm going to be doing wheelies on this thing constantly. So we want to make sure it doesn't no, rattle not. all over the so place. It's not your bike. Hey, you know what time it is, teens? It is dunk time. Aw. Wow. 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 Oh, God, you pumped that bike so oh, well. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, my How God. Uh, probably about there is good. I'd say there is good. That's oh, good. Thank you. Call me anytime. I'll come pump up your. I. Never mind. I. I'm stop. Yeah. Just get. Just go. Just leave. Little robot face. See. Uh huh. You come out. I'm gonna put this thing in there. So Dotto got it in. Yes, I did. <laughs> So it looks like the top part is installed and looks beautiful. I actually love that silver being covered up because it completes the stealth look. Batman told me if I don't get these radiator guards on, he's not going to ride this. <laughs> so, Something fitting the lower radiator cover on right now. Right meow. There you go. Oh, perfect. Oh, yeah. Oh, God. I hope you got so, that on film. It feels so good. Yeah. Team Buckets is getting. Her eagle nose in, in, the, in this business. Mm -hmm. Tightening down the left hand side. Bet she's not even tightening up. Thick. Dotto. Okay, you know what? Tighten it down. I'm double checking. Bet she's not even tightening up, then she double checks. She oh, never knows tight. how hard to tighten oh, down the bolt. Tight. Did I you tighten that tight. hard? I tightened it really hard. My little, my little sausages are. Oh, look, he's going over there to check. He went over to check. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, up next are the carbon brake duct. Brake ducts? So we're gonna go ahead coolers. and break the coolers, thank you. It also protects from rocks and debris and stuff like that from getting stuck in your brake calipers, which is really nice. No? Dado's praying. <laughs> I didn't I didn't do it yet. You didn't? You need me to get it? Um no. No. Alright, so just fitting on the ducks right there. God, it looks so good. Would you just look at it? What do you think about those, Dado? I think they're pretty sweet. You want them for your scrambler bill, don't you? Um, my scrambler bill will have zero carbon on it. <laughs> it'll just be, it'll have mud on it. 
Yeah, like some mod accessories. We gotta figure out the torque specs here. Yeah, we'll have to grab the manual and take a look. But uh, I really like the way those look, especially because it's just like more carbon on the bike. Mmm, looks so good. And yes, that shock is gonna be powder coated black, so don't worry, guys. Well, I think the patrons wanted black. We're gonna take a look, but that'll be coming in a future episode as well. But yeah, is that one side on? I just gotta torque it down. Okay. Dotto's got his tool. 45 meters. His torque wrench, team. It's not a tool, his torque wrench. It's a tool. Oh, it's a tool, right. It's a tool, and Jared. <laughs> Torquing it down to the proper torque specs, which was what, Dotto? 45. 45? Newton meters. There it is. I'm gonna do each one of those, and then we'll repeat the process on the right-hand side. Done. Repeating the process for the right-hand side. Also, one thing that we didn't mention, the little spacers that they have here, um, they didn't mention in the, in the directions whether they should be on the left or right-hand side. We kept them underneath and hit them, like that. Hit them. And just tightening it down, and then we'll get the tor torque wrench, the torch wrench. The torque wrench down on this side as well. We're gonna be torching this whole front end. <laughs> We're gonna torch the whole front end. I really like these, I think, I think they look really cool. And they serve a great purpose. I get too. it, they look really cool. Get it, see what I did there? No, uh, I, you had no idea. I did. I'm, I'm always a ton of words. I'm a wordsmith. He's just trying to be as punny as possible. Um, <laughs> super punny. There it is. I love the sound and the feel of a proper torque spec. Here, would you like to click? Yes, can I? Oh, God, you made Something's me Something's gonna sick. get broken. Easy, easy, Tiger. I don't know that. Oh, God, that's good. That feels so, so good. I'm gonna call you later. <laughs> All right, so up next, we're gonna put the stickers on, the factory stickers. Um, Teens is going to wipe down the bike to make sure the bike is just completely nice and pristine and clean and so the stickers will not only stick properly but also just so it looks really nice as well. And our oily residue's off. Yeah, all the oils and everything's off of it. And then we'll take it outside and take some nice photos. But we're getting there guys. I can't wait until that shock is powder coated. Uh, we have a carbon kickstand coming as well so that'll be carbon. And yeah, slowly but surely we're getting there. Yeah. It doesn't look dirty, but look at that. Anything that's in Dotto's garage is gonna get dirty. <laughs> Dotto just got a package, and look what it is. Pneumatic stapler, a poultry stapler. Poultry? A, you know what I meant. You know, chicken stapler. Yeah, so no more BS staples for our custom seat covers anymore. <sighs> yeah. Dozer also got some mail. Dozer gets mail too. Dozer's got a ton of fans. <laughs> He's always getting fan mail. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna let the artist work on the the stickers, actually Teens is a little artist too. But we're gonna start off with the tank stickers, which say Ducati in black. So we're gonna put those on, and we're just kind of comparing them to the stock tank to figure out exactly where they go. So we're gonna just match everything exactly with stock. So the last thing we're doing before we put on the stickers is putting some prep all on there and just making sure that surface is ready to go. So those stickers stay on and don't go flying down, flying off while you're riding down the road. How about it, Dotto? How about it? With the sausage grease from Dotto's hands, mm -hmm. you gotta be real careful. We're turning this carbon into gloss carbon now. <laughs> Alright, first sticker going on. Dotto used to do this stuff for a living, so... Yet another reason why he's the man. Looks good. Mm -hmm. I think it's good. Let's go. I'm let's go even. drink. Let's go <laughs> drink, yeah. Peel her off, let's see what it looks like. Oh my god, I love it already. Oh my wow. god. Yep. Black. Black That's... was the way to go. <laughs> I can't wait to get the rest of these on. All right, so the other side he's about to peel off. And I also wanted to mention, guys, we're going to send along the silver set of decals. So if somebody wants to remove these and put silver on or do whatever they want to do, you guys can always do that. We also have tank pads we're going to send along with the new owner as well. But, dude, I really like this a lot. The black looks so freaking awesome. Good shit, man. All right, so next will be the fairings. And as you can see, it looks really weird on the fairing because of this line coming down here. So it's actually just lined up with this line right there. So that's what we're gonna do on ours. Dotto's trimming it up to give himself a little bit better thing to work with there. So let's see how this works out. All right, installing it on the side here. 
use a piece of tape to make sure it stays in place. We lined it up based on the stock fairing. And there she goes. That's pretty good. Yeah. Straight. Yep. Looks awesome. Cool. Now he's laying the other side down. There you go. Now he's just going to rub it all on there. Rub it all. Rub on. it all nice and juicy. Oops, don't uh -oh. tear that. Don't tear it, Dad. Uncle Jared only got us one set. Because <laughs> I knew you were the best, Otto. <laughs> All right, moment of truth. Let's see how it goes. Let's see how it looks. The blacked out. Oh my God. Wow. It looks amazing. <laughs> that looks really good. I'm obsessed, guys. Look at the blacked out decals on that thing. Oh my God. What do you guys think? Beautiful. Love it? That's awesome. Yep. That's really good. Epic. Yeah, Let's keep going. Wow. This looks so good, guys. Let's flip this down. Look at that. I really, really like it. The black just looks mm, so sick. Uh, let's go to the tail section and then we'll do the one on the front next. Prepping the surface for the backside. It's got a little Ducati with the Italian flag on it there. I don't know if it's showing up or not. Oh, there they gave is. us R's. For yeah, they gave us R's. We might put the R's on. We'll see. What? All right. Let's see how the rear tail section looks here on the Look at that flag. right hand side. Oh my God. It's so badass. I love it, dude. Good job. Okay. okay. Final sticker. Boom. Beautiful, man. So now we got all the stickers on. We'll take it outside and look at it out there because I'm gonna take some photos anyway. Sure. Good job, Dotto. Thanks. I dig it. I really, really like it. So we decided we're gonna leave the front sticker off because we don't like the asymmetrical look. And I like nothing on the front. I think it looks really good. Instead of just having one Ducati sticker right here, I think it's just better without it. But what do you... we are gonna include it with the winner in case he wants to. Put yeah, it on there. he or she. Or he or she. Yeah. Right? In I don't think they want to put it on there. I don't think there's any need to have that and on we'll there. And we'll send along the other stickers too. Yeah. All right, so I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of the Carbon Panigale series. Um, we got the radiator guards, blacked out radiator guards installed. We got the carbon fiber uh, brake cooling ducts installed. And we got the factory blacked out gloss stickers installed. Really, really happy with how it's coming along. Little touches like that that really set the bike off. And we've got a few more left to do. So um, if you guys enjoyed it, make sure to give the video a thumbs up. If you want to be uh, entered to win this motorcycle, check out the Patreon page. It's always linked in the description below. If you want any of the parts we got, they'll all be linked in the description below as well. Shout out to our sponsor, Motor Million. Thank you to Otto for your hard work. Thank you, team, for filming. I will see you guys in the next one.